Get back in the hall. Get in there now. All of you. You heard what I said about detention. All right. You made your point. But let me make something very clear. Anyone, and I mean anyone who is still here in five seconds will be in extended detention. Five. Four. What, Dad? Are you going to put all of us in detention? Three. Two. Because maybe if all of us are problem kids, it's not actually the kids who have the problem. One. Are you stupid? You pay for that. Thank you. Thank you for confirming what I said earlier. That you have all got it in you to shine. You're angry and you have expressed it calmly and patiently. And I am so proud of you for that. Because believe me, I share your anger. I am angry that the scales are weighted so much against so many of us. And sometimes that anger boils over, I know it does. Now maybe you came to school this morning with no breakfast. Oh, no shoes. Or you've got no home to go back to. Or, or you have spent the day worrying that when you do leave here, you're not gonna be safe. You have got every right to feel that. <clears throat> but what you do not have is the right to turn that anger into violence because the minute you do that, you, you, just, you just lose the argument. What did she mean? Violence. A knife. Danny had a knife. Which is why I cannot defend what happened here today. So I am asking you now, please don't lose this argument. Be angry, be angry. But you have to step aside. Let him go. Guys, come on, show's over. Let him pass, come on. Come on. 